I'm Sergeant Paul Penzone. Our crime training of the month is called phishing, but it's not the phishing you used to do with your grandfather. This is what fraudsters do when they go online and use spam, pop-ups, or email to try to defraud you of your personal information, of your checking account, credit cards, and other financial information that can be helpful to them. Here are some tips that'll keep you from getting hooked. Don't rely on email or pop-up messages that ask for personal or financial information. If you need to reach an organization you do business with, call the number on your financial statements or on the back of your credit card. Use antivirus and anti-spyware software as well as a firewall and update them regularly. Don't email personal or financial information. Review credit card and bank account statements to check for unauthorized charges. Be cautious about opening any attachments or downloading any files from emails you receive, regardless of who sent them. Be aware, if an offer sounds too good to be true, it probably is. You need to take steps to protect yourself and your family, so if you didn't initiate the purchase, there's no reason to provide any financial information. If you have any questions or would like some information regarding phishing, please contact Silent Witness at 480-948-6377 or log on to www.silentwitness.org. If you suspect or would like to report online phishing, please go to ftc.gov backslash ID theft.